Hola. Soy Dora. No, she's on her period. <laughs> Whatever. Um, today we are making pizza. I'm Unique. Chris. If you haven't watched our video before, don't forget to subscribe. And also, um, I always leave our social medias down below. So you can always follow. I know some people have been following us. Well, so thank you. Following her, which is fine. I'm fine with that. Um, thank you for doing that. I'm making pizza today. Um, and usually when I cook, I'm, I'm the cook. Um, often I like to, I usually cook a wine a lot. Um, not really much options to usually here today, which we could, but um, I usually like to sip wine while I cook, so um, I'm getting her to sip some wine with me. I let her pick out the brand and... I wanted the... She picked the brand them. out, I picked out the specific Flame. bottle. Yeah. But yeah, so we're gonna... Um, Drink wine and make pizza. There you go, sir. I guess we'll say our ingredients. So we got mozzarella cheese. We got it was buy one, get one free at Publix. Um, if you're familiar with Florida, Florida folks know about Publix. <laughs> Probably get one free on the cheese. Um, and then we got just pizza sauce, classico, and then we have Italian crumpled sausage. I it's, won't be using. It's grand, it's spicy Italian sausage. I basically just took it. Um, one second, I'll show you. Bought some sausage again from Publix, um, and I just took it out of the uh, the casing and lining and just crumbled it up. I'm gonna be having on my pizza the sausage and. Uh, green peppers. This psychopath is having a rare and elusive. We, we have pineapples. I don't know if you can see that or not. And jalapenos. I might put jalapenos on mine. I'm not sure. Well, jalapenos are definitely my idea, but she likes them too, so. And then wine. If you want to get the four right. ounce and flour, I'll get the wine going. This is cheap wine. Cheap wine. It's a good wine. Though. Is it good enough? Make like a double portion in case it rips. Do you know how work though? Hmm? Do you know how work though? Work? I thought I was gonna roll the pizzas. Yeah, I'm saying do you know how to work, roll, work dough? Oh, I forgot, she works, she makes pizza. I do this for a living. I forgot, yeah, so she makes pizza. I used to work at a pizza place. I worked at a few, but. Um, well, I don't work at a pizza place, but we just have pizza. I guess it is considered a pizza place. Are, Anyways, we, doing like two, are we doing like two little ones, or like yeah. a big one, half and half? Or? I don't know. And I washed my hands. I didn't wash my hands, man oh, style. Maybe. Man style. I'm just joking, folks. You know the virus. Can't say it, but I definitely wash my hands. Well, we have to cut it in half. Do I know how to work, though? It's a valid question. No, I do this every morning, literally. Yours is big. This is gonna. I don't like this door. It's hard to work with. I used to make this when I was a kid. You guys didn't even see me as a sandwich if you do. I squish it down. This stuff is hard to work with. But doing my job is easier. Maybe it's. My arms hurt already. Oh lord. <laughs> Well, this is gonna be real ugly. Let me try. Babe, you're gonna get flour everywhere. How is yours a circle? I think it's just so ugly. Well, you know that in real pizzas aren't exactly a circle, right? Why if you go to Italy, I'm pretty sure pizzas are commonly have irregular shapes. I promise my pizzas at work look better than this. You got too much fire, first of all. Hello? Yeah, what's up? Alright, so good news. Uh, we just sold the house. I'll drink some wine today. So, um, long story short, uh, my father passed away a few years ago. He willed us his property, but um, we were finally able to sell one of them. So, we made a video uh, surprise. 
Okay. Back to the pizza. So, I'm going to teach Bay how to work the pizza because she over here struggling. Can I have yours? Though, just like any cooking, you know, takes time. You need some patience. Put a little love into it. You got to treat this dough like you're going to have make love. You got to be a gentleman. time you made homemade pizza? I don't remember. You remember? I know it was with my mom, but we made it so many times when I was young. When was the first time you made? Yeah, the first time I made homemade pizza. Did, I was you ever, did you ever make those pizzas with the English muffin and you put the sauce on and you put the cheese on top? No, nah, we I didn't. I used to make those. I didn't really do stuff like that growing up, to be honest. There was too many of us. It was just too much work. My mom had five kids. Yeah, my mom had seven and she was a lot older than us, so. When what? was the first time you realized you eat friggin' pineapple, pineapple on pizza? pizza. Yeah. When did that happen? When? That's Confusing. a good question, actually. I don't remember you guys have a bad memory. Like drizzle of olive oil? I'm just going to do the edges of my other stuff. Yeah, I think you do the bottom. I put way too much. Mm. Yeah, I'll take some of yours. How about how's that? Mine's not all the way circle. Mine's is not a circle either, so I don't think anyone's judging. <sighs> well, mine's more circle than yours, but you also made this one. But you are covered in flour. Oh, shoot. She's wearing black. Let's do this. <laughs> Pizza sauce. So, <laughs> we got... Olive oil on the bottom, whole thing, and on top, just the edges. There's the pizza. Go ahead and do that uh and uh. Now, the first time I made pizza, I made a mistake of putting way too much sauce. Because mm -hmm. I like sauce, and it was just like, kind of ruined it. Um, and I still always tempted to put like a lot of sauce. I'm going to try my best not to do, put too much sauce. Because I don't like that dry, Who, you know, no one likes a dry pizza. I also put too much cheese and toppings as well. I brought you a spoon. The sauce actually smells pretty good. It's classico, traditional pizza sauce. Yeah, it's the same kind of, um, I use, I like my, my pasta, you know, spaghetti sauce homemade, but when I don't, I use the classico. I'm not endorsing them, they're not paying me or anything, but. Cheese time. Folks, feel free to choose your own sauce. I like, um, a lot of cheese. This is fun. I think I'll top off my. What um? What other questions do you have for me? That's a good question. Um, good question. I had five too many tequila shots last night. She only had five, but I'll, five too many is a good statement. Um, what was the? Do you remember the first time you tried? You got drunk. I do. It was really fun, and it was wine. I actually got wine drunk, which is honestly the best drunk like I've been. Like. It's like a really good feeling of being drunk, I guess. But I don't really drink that much. And if I do drink, I don't always get drunk. Like, I usually will drink. Like, this wine, I probably will barely finish it. Um, it just depends. Who are you drinking with? Oh, my friends. It was a group of us. I was 16. Were you so illegal? Yeah, I was 16. It was really fun, though. But, oops. Sorry, Mom. The first time I got drunk, I definitely was not 16. I was 15. That's a lot of cheese, babe. She, she thought she got extra cheese. I got extra cheese. I like cheese, you know what I mean? Hit it with some green peppers. Gotta have your veggies, folks. You took all of the cheese. I'm glad we got two. But I won't get one free. I keep telling you. The only vegetables I really like on my pizza is um peppers and onions. Mushrooms, I guess. Not really mushroom. Huge mushroom fan. I like mushrooms. I'm not mad at their owner, but I'm not requesting. You know what I mean? And then we're gonna hit it with some. Hit it with the whoops. Some uh, pork. Oh, some we sausage. should put garlic on the crust. It seems very garlicky. I mean, be cooking pizza was not that expensive. It's pretty cheap, actually. 
I don't remember how much you we spent. Thirty dollars. Yeah, but that's, that, that's because we got olive oil, which is almost five bucks. And we only gonna use it this one time, but we're gonna have it, you know, forever. But we got other things. We got also got um, flour. But we got the instant. Maybe that's true. We just got the toppings really in the dough. The dough wasn't expensive though. It was like three two ninety nine. Yeah, I mean, I think really the most expensive thing was my sausage was five bucks, but. And we already had pizza sauce. I want some jalapenos here. I got jalapenos and pineapple on. So. Uh, that's pretty much it. I think the last step is I'm gonna hit it with. I always I love pepper. So a little bit of cracked black pepper just to season it. Oregano for some freshness. Oregano. I think you put crushed peppers on after. You can put crushed peppers on after, but if you love them, you can put it on. After and before. That makes sense. I'm after, gonna leave mine plain. Before and after. I'm getting a pineapple. I'll drink some wine. I love red pepper so much, I'm not even gonna put the cat back. I'm just gonna be dangerous and sprinkle it on there. I live life dangerously, folks. You only get one. So, pizza's done. Um, I'm gonna put it in the oven. I'm gonna have a really good time eating this, I feel like. That looks good, yeah. Now, here's the logistics of getting it from here to the oven. Um, you folks can't see that part. It's a secret. No, it's not a secret. We'll it's put, just we'll put the camera angle. Are we angling the camera? Yeah. Okay, I guess you folks get to see it, whatever. I think we should cut it here, right up the middle. Oh, yeah. Cut it and, like, in, okay. in sections. You cut it because I'm You should get a knife because last time I cut something, I used my hand and she was very unhappy about it. All right, so cooking a 400. I took the rack out. It's not hot yet, so that's why I'm not burning myself. Speaking of burn, don't look at that. Um, but I got the rack right in the middle. That way, um, the ingredients are cooked, you know, evenly. And now we forgot to preheat the oven, so I guess we're gonna wait for the preheating. In the meantime, you know what we're gonna do. Hey, that's fine. All right, so oven lights off means oven is successfully preheated. Don't mind this pot, I'm brother for to cook some lunch. Yeah. Um, in the meantime, let's get these pizzas in the oven. So you're gonna have to fold that, pull this out. This is dangerous folks, never use a knife around your partner. Is mine going on the top? They're both gonna go on the top. This is dangerous. Uh-oh. Dangerous. I don't think they're gonna fit on the top. You'll fit big Sometimes you gotta make them fit. They lift up like that, make a little fake tray, and we're good to go. So, so these are in the oven. Cooking, now it's all about the weight gain. And lunch. All right, so the pizza's finished. They're kind of a little well done because of me. At least I know the dough is done. Mine's is fine. Like yeah, his looks good. It looks, but if you break it, there's white cheese there. Okay. I got a jalapeno pineapple pizza. She cut it. Probably was in there about five minutes too. But definitely still edible. Mine's is perfectly fine. Um, oh, I'm going to cut it. Honestly, even though even though it's a little overcooked, it looks. Uh, yeah, it looks good, fun. So. Should I taste this? Stuff? I feel like that's definitely gonna burn your mouth. I'm blowing it. Oh. <laughs> Seems like you're enjoying it. It's actually really good, yeah. I think like the inside is fine. I think the top just looks like overdone, but it tastes normally. Mm. All right, well, mm. that pretty much um, video will be concluded. Nice having you folks around. Um, go ahead, video. make your own pizza. Let us know how it went. Mm -hmm. 
I'm sure like next time we'll do better, but these seem pretty good. Um, and also don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also again, our social medias are always in the description box below. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. All right, so the video was over, but this pizza is like dope. She is like eating through the whole pizza right now. Um, I just had my first piece and man, it's like, it's good. Like, um, it's not flat. Like I wanted to, you know, I like flat pizza. So, you know, it's not perfect, but I would give this an eight out of 10. Like the red pepper, jalapenos, green, like what, what, what would you give your pizza bear? Eight out of 10. Eight out of 10? Okay. Yeah. Hers looks really good too. A pineapple right there. That, that bite looks like it would be fire. Jalapeno pineapple. Extra crispy cheeks. All right, folks. So, um, yeah. Pizza's bomb. We'll see you later.